Hey guys, welcome back to another new tutorial of PowerPoint School and today I will show you how to make this animated mobile icons in just PowerPoint. So without wasting your time, let's start our tutorial. At first, we have to pick a oval shape, holding the Ctrl Shift from your keyboard, drag it over here, place it in the middle of our slide, then go to Format, click on Shape Fill, change the color. Then from Shape Outline, select No Outline. Now we have to pick a rounded corner rectangle, drag it over this circle, decrease the roundness of it by dragging this yellow dot, place it in the middle of the circle, then from shape fill change the color and from shape outline select no outline. This time we have to pick a rectangle shape, drag it over here, now change its color from shape fill and select no outline. After that, pick a oval shape, make it a small circle, change its color from shape fill and select no outline from shape outline. Place it in the middle, select this rounded corner rectangle, press Ctrl D to duplicate, increase the roundness, make it a smaller one, then from shape fill change its color Place it here, this will be our home button, so I'm just decreasing its size and place it here in the middle. Now we have to create the other necessary elements. So select this rectangle, press Ctrl D to duplicate, change its color to white from shape fill, resize it, place it here, pick a triangle, make it a smaller one. Drag this yellow dot to the left, rotate it, make it a bit smaller, change its color to white and select no outline, place over here. Then just make a duplicate of this small rounded corner rectangle, bring it to here, resize it, here I'm just making a few copy and changing their color to decorate this shape. Now select all of these and press Ctrl G to group. This time again make a duplicate of this small rectangle, resize it, make it a thinner one, change its color to white, holding the Ctrl Shift from your keyboard drag it to right and it will be duplicated, change the color of the new one. Here I'm resizing it a bit, make a duplicate of this circle, place over here. Now holding the control button, select this 3 and press Ctrl G to group. After that, we have to create the third element. And for this, again, we will make a duplicate of this rectangle shape, make it a smaller one, bring it to here. Here you can see that I am just using the rectangles to decorate our necessary elements. And then, Select this shape and press Ctrl G to make them group. Here I am doing the same, making a smaller rectangle. Over this I am placing a heart shape and changing its color. Select this too, press Ctrl G to group. In the same way you can create the other necessary elements. So to save your time, I'll go back to my previous slide and from here I'll copy the rest of the element by pressing Ctrl C and paste it here by pressing Ctrl V. Here you can see that all the elements are made of rectangles. So I don't think you will face any type of difficulties. So now to add the animation, go to animation, click on animation pane to look over our animation status. Now select this first element. From add animation, select zoom. Set start on click and duration 0.35 second. Select the second element. From add animation, select zoom. Set start with previous, duration 0.35 second and make the delay 0 0.05 second. Select the third one. From add animation, select zoom. Set start with previous, duration 0.35 second. Select the fourth one. From add animation, again select zoom. Set start with previous, duration 0.35 second and delay 0 0.10 seconds. Now select this one. From add animation, Select zoom, set start with previous, duration 0.35 second. For this element, 
from add animations like zoom, set start width previous, duration 0.35 second, delay 0.15 second. Select this element from add animation. Again, we have to select zoom, set start width previous, duration 0.35 second, and delay 0.20 second. For this last element from add animation, select zoom, set start with previous, duration 0.35 seconds and delay 0.25 seconds. And we are done. Now if you start the slideshow, you can see that our whole animation is working perfectly. Like this way, you can create this one or this one. And also you can download this template for free. I've given the download link in the video description. If you have enjoyed this tutorial, make sure you give a like on this video. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, make sure you subscribe, share with your friends and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get time to time notifications from this channel. Hope to see you in the next tutorial and thanks for watching.